The air was full of frost, the manor full of punch and excitement. United were charged up, Southampton were run down. It was a classic cup time. At first, the Yellows tried too hard. The Saints sat back and waited, and then pounced on goal with a fearsome drive from Richard Dryden. The manor was shocked. Question was, were United shaken? They answered the only way they know, with fire and passion. In the second half, Southampton were put to the sword. It was all united. Sometime, somehow, a goal had to come. Martin Aldridge suffered more than most. He could have walked away with the match ball as a hat-trick of chances whistled by. The red and white shirts of the Saints tried to throw up a defensive wall as United hit them with everything they had. Paul Moody, once a Southampton player, once United's top goalscorer, was thrown on to the delight of the crowd. And slowly but surely the aim got better. Southampton shivered and the bar shaped. After Darren Purse had seen a goal-scoring chance come and go, skipper Mike Ford threw himself at the next one, which went even closer. The minutes ticked by, the game slipped away. Southampton held out as United tried desperately to hold on. 90 minutes were gone and injury time was nearly up when United went for one last charge and Paul Moody for one last charge. 